Today is December 16th, the year 2022. It is 2022 since the birth of our Lord Jesus Christ. And professional day traders talk about uh, something called chasing money and chasing the process. Chasing money will cause an individual to be addicted to a surface level of satisfaction. It is essentially similar to uh, achieving a surface level uh, just like in nature there is a little aphid that has little sugary water that comes pops out of his butt it eats the leaves and processes it and changes it into uh, a sugary uh, blob the ants who attend to the uh, surrounding area uh, consumes the sugary water and 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 protects those little little um, little little aphids. Now these ants are uh, are on a surface level being satisfied with each drop of excrement, which is essentially a sugary water to the ants that the aphids generate by consuming the tree around it. That is exactly what uh, inflow and exflow of money is in day trading. Professional day traders talk about this, but they don't go into detail of the reasoning behind why uh, novice traders are that way and then professional day traders are another way. There are several instances uh, being demonstrated by uh, professional day traders on their uh, vlog, of uh, uh, video log of what they do. They show what they do on a daily basis, such as maintaining their body and then uh, performing studies and, and on, on Saturdays and Sundays and evenings and all, all manner of hours. One in particular is um, a gentleman named, um, what, what, is, what is his name? His name is uh, um, uh, Zoopoli or Zopoli or something, something like that. His, 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 um, name is, um, uh, escapes me right now, but he's, he's the individual who initially, uh, um, uh, spent an enormous amount of time pursuing his craft, not focusing on money, but spending night and day studying the intricacies uh, and the behavior of the stock market in order to harness the power of the knowledge that he's built. So he essentially elevated, stacked the experiences underneath him to the point where he's reached and summited Mount Everest of Wall Street. And what seems to distinguish between this what seems to separate between a novice day trader and a professional day trader is that the professional day traders do take things very seriously about the craft that they have, have uh, uh, they have deeply become uh, involved in They're they are now in fully on the deep end of the pool and with and, and treading and surviving is a is a is a matter of studying and that is the distinction between a quick fix immediate three minute satisfaction or is it a lifelong incremental each moment of studying that is a satisfaction and and creating a experience that elevates the individual to the point where at a certain time when the time is right and God speed not the not the speed that I have because my view of the point at the point where I become consistently profitable is nowhere in sight. I can only assume it's somewhere up there. God knows. And when God says that it's time, it's time. 
and that can only be achieved by separating between creating a separation between the 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 focus on the contributing factors of the money factor in day trading and and placing the emphasis back on to the subject matter of day trading to create an environment that elevates it's like stacking telephone books one by one one by one piling up piling up piling up until at a point where the the amount of books and the knowledge and the experience that supports the solid foundation of my existence as a day trader reaches and surpasses the elevation at a point where 10 percent 5 percent and 1 percent of individuals who are constantly performing their duties and in order to survive in the day trading world and that can only be done by being a student of the market.